What is up, YouTube? It is your boy Jad here from Pumba Plow playing some more railroads online. We're back. We're ready. Let's get to it. Hello. Hello. Uh, what's popping? Uh, Sorry, just gonna be a little bit late tonight. Okay, that's fine. I was told to uh, pass along the message. Oh, okay. All good. All good. Oh, Black Hat's here too. I didn't know Black Hat was here. I thought, like, I knew he was here, but, like, I didn't know he was here. Sorry. Why is this train rolling backwards? I don't know. You missed the uh, good old scene. Heart attack. Oh, yeah? What's up? Uh, when me and Black Hat joined. Yeah. My engine, my tender, and four cars rolling. Really? The engine was upside down. Full car or the tender was off the rails. What? Three cars were off the rails. What? Log out, log back in, and they're all hooked back in. Oh, <laughs> I was like, there's no way. Well, that's right. I turned. Chat, I turned the whistle way down. Or I turned the sound effects way down after Sarge bought that engine, and Trent also now owns the same engine that Sarge has with that loud, loud, loud whistle. It's not loud if you don't fully it's loud. engage the whistle. So we may have to, we'll have to play with our audio tonight, but it was way too much last week. I couldn't, it's too much. Buy it at 14%. We might have to turn it up a little bit yet, but we'll see. Go for it, just a little bit, Trent. Okay, Black Hat, you're in the game too? Okay. Yeah. Cool. What are you guys working on? Logs. Logs. Uh, that? first time I did, I, I don't want it, whatever that little car thing is. Or Chinese rocket debris, yeah, I don't want it. It is kind of nice to have my whole train fit in one of those 10 sightings up here. Right? Yeah. So, I'm going to come over there and grab some core wood. Okay. If y'all are cool with that. I do have the extension open, but I'm only going to use it minimally. And we're not doing the web part, so hopefully it works. Actually, how many cars do I have here? One, two, three, four, five, eight. Yeah, we'll go with eight. Why not? That's enough cars for this engine. <laughs> okay, first time that's air tire to be that's kind of cool. That'd be sick to have at the farm, wouldn't it? I gotta turn on the uh, rear rear light, black cat. Oh boy. <laughs> the rear light, huh? Wait, what engine? Oh, you have the big engine, right? Yeah, I got my engine. Okay. I wasn't and sure. Then, and the two helpers. Yeah, the, yeah. For some reason, you, yeah, I don't know why you have Betsy's on there. You don't gotta need them. Keep, gotta keep along the OGs. No. <laughs> you don't need them. You have more than enough oomph to make it up the hill with your uh, your giant engine. That's all right. I have an itch to go up to coal mine just for the. Well, if you're going to coal mine, we'll give you something to pull, not just empty, you know. Which actually, we need. You know what? Maybe we'll make that our goal tonight is to get to the coal mine with uh, with stuff. It needs rail right now. The problem is yeah, that there is no rail. That stuff is heavy. Never enough power. Mine and Sarge's train. We have no issue going up the hill. My, my engine's fine too. This engine that I'm running now may not, may not do it. What's up, Carson? I have an what? idea for you. What's your idea, Carson? You change your pop filter out on your microphone for a green one, so there's just a hole in like your neck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here for it. So it's just like, like, like my cup, just like, like this, yeah. just all the time. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> this is gonna make it really hard to game with. I have to hold my cup up here. I need a straw. Thank you for the deep thoughts by Carson. Really appreciate. And then it. a green shirt. I just thought of that one myself. No, you <laughs> Nobody helped you with that idea. No. In-house, John. Oh, that's good, Carson. Good job. Good job. I 
just gave me an idea. Repeat everything I said in the last 90 seconds. Um, Help. I. He re what what he meant to say oh. was, give me money, sub to me, so you don't have to watch it. Wow, I never. Said. No, I wouldn't say that, Carson. I wouldn't say that. No. I would not say that. But you know, if somebody wants to sub up, that's fine. I, I'm not gonna stop anyone. Dave, you didn't have to do that. <laughs> Just for the record, you didn't have to do that. Dang it, Dave. I was <laughs> Dave, I uh, appreciate the gift sub, thank you. Trent, do you want to roll back a little bit? Yeah, hold on, hold on one second. <laughs> okay, why does this wing planter take 20 years to unfold? Which, what do you have, the the one that like we have now? Yes. Right, it does take a minute, but it's a cool planter, isn't it? It's cool, but I like when it's all folded up and you open the covers on it. Yeah. There's like a whole bunch of lids just flop uh -huh. open. Oh, hey, hey this... Nope. No breaks. No breaks. Uh, Shrat, thanks for the gift sub. Hang on. All right. Bro cranes, let's go, y'all. Oh, man. It's funny that Chuck was going to do it. You guys appreciate the. It's the thought that counts sometimes, chat. Farmer Nick 16 just oh. subscribed just for ended. 60 months. Hey, Farmer hey. Nick. Farmer Nick, thanks for the resub. How are you? Oh, it's Grandpa. Just like I was almost Snapchatting him. Or... Wait, when you do the, the hype chat, it doesn't tell you where it's charging you for Chinese Rocket Debris? What? It was yesterday. Two forwards, please. That's kind of funny, though, right? Oh, Trent, I heard that. I, I barely <laughs> even did half. <laughs> I heard that. I like heard 40%. that. Forty percent. That's so loud. Uh, it's probably just your saved, like whatever you have saved on Twitch. Wasn't the same. Okay. Interesting. How about that, Black Cat? Sean, it's just like uh, super chat from YouTube, see. basically, is what it is. It's called hype chat, but it's pretty much the same thing as super chat from YouTube. Just a little bit forward. So there you go. Uh, Chatty's Rocket Debris, thanks for the buck. With the no, no hype buck, chat. No buck fitty. Good. Buck fitty? No, it's a buck. Technically 70 cents. Whatever. <laughs> you know. Well, Jeffrey's got to get his cut. And that's fine. But Carson, I couldn't figure out where you like heard that from. But it's totally a thing. Because we, like, we did math last night in TeamSpeak. Okay. It's it says a... right on the thing. Does it? Yeah. Oh, okay. I didn't see it in the email. That's why I was confused. Uh, roll a little bit forward, Trent. Well, they probably didn't put it in. They did. Knowing them, they 100% did not put it in. Good, super tired, but good. Awesome, Farmer Nick. Come on, engine. Come on, engine. This engine sucks, by the way. <laughs> not a fan. No. Should be good. You don't like the good engine you said, John. I mean, maybe if we're pulling like a car. I said it was good. When did I say that? I I take that back. I I I retract my previous statement. Apparently, that's all right. Am I good, Black Cat? So Chuck, the way bits work, you know. If you want to buy 10,000 bits, it costs you a hundred and whatever dollars. It's more than a hundred dollars, right? But if you give 10,000 bits to your streamer, your streamer gets a hundred bucks. So whatever bits you give, your streamer gets all of that. Should be good right there. But basically bits, you pay the, the Twitch cut up front with this super chat thing. If you want to do a hundred bucks, it's a hundred bucks. And then the cut comes out after. So it's kind of interesting, but it's it's the same thing as YouTube uh, that they have now, which is what everybody's been complaining that we want Twitch to be more like YouTube. So I guess this is uh, one of their steps to 
to try to do that, you know? So, it is what it is. Chuck, thanks for the 30 bits. Appreciate Hold it. Your... Hold the cup up to your, like, where your microphone I'm... was. No, thank you. Why? <laughs> thanks, Chuck. Uh, sure. Yes. Because <laughs> you're going to do something silly, Carson. That's why. No. Yes. No. <laughs> yeah, you are. John, it's content. <laughs> content, John. I guess you can probably <laughs> see it. <laughs> <I'm sorry. laughs> that's awesome. It's, oh, that's the picture of me without a hat on. No. <laughs> no. Oh. No. Not okay. Not okay. Not okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh god! <laughs> Might better so, have clipped that. Trent, how much uh, water do you have in your boiler right now? Uh, I almost have two thousand. Oh, okay. I have one thousand nine hundred and twenty-eight. Dropping. Uh, the reason why I'm asking. Uh, apparently, there's a water gauge on the Betsy's you can see. Really? Yeah. I see work. Uh, I think so. Actually, I think so, oh. but. Uh, Vegas Bull, you rather pay the cut than make the streamer? I mean, it is, it's six, one, half dozen, the other, you know? I guess. Oh, that's not Gmail. Hold on. This has been working for YouTube, you know? So, I guess maybe it'll work here on Twitch. I don't, I don't really know. I don't have an opinion either way. The, the only thing I will say is I like that, um, we, we could actually turn it off. You can turn it off. I did see that on Twitch last night when I was looking around a little bit. Uh, the other thing is that you still there still are bits, you know, so if people want to do bits, they can still do that. Um, and then, you know, I'm surprised it's not a thing yet, to be honest, with the way the, the whole Twitch thing is right now. But like, you know, I'm surprised that Twitch still allows you to have a donate button to like a PayPal. And of course, I'm not saying that anybody has to hit that button, but I'm just surprised that Twitch hasn't outlawed that yet. But that's probably coming. Same. Probably. Yeah. Because you can even run like a sponsor of the channel, right? Yeah. Well, you can. It's just, yeah. But it's like, you know, of course they would want all the dollars to go through them, you know, which mm -hmm. makes sense from a business standpoint. I get it. Because they want their money. They want their, they want their hand. I'm just surprised that they haven't uh, outlawed that yet. So I'm sure it'll happen soon, though. I'm sure. Actually, I don't think they can. Why? You don't think they could limit what's in people's panels? <laughs> well, not the no sense in the outlawing the PayPal part. Yeah. It's the PayPal is more of like a banking app. So if you get rid of a banking app, you start losing revenue at that point. True. But PayPal, like Twitch, doesn't make anything if somebody donates to PayPal. You know what True. Saying? True, but. Yeah, Twitch doesn't have their finger on that at all. Although it's funny because they pay out through PayPal. That's how Twitch yeah. pays. So yeah, maybe they won't do it. A lot of businesses do, surprisingly. Yeah. That's your aunt. Chat, get your earplugs out. Surprised he hasn't lit us up yet. Oh, he timed out. No. <laughs> and he's back. Trent. Okay, can you stop the train? <laughs> yeah, I'm working on it. Stop the train. Uh, <laughs> I was talking to you, Trent. I'm like, I'm surprised he hasn't lit us up yet. And then time out. Oh, man. Well, I didn't hear you talking on stream. I was like, oh, yep. Yep. Stop, stop the train. It's a freight train, baby. <laughs> Look stop, out. Stop, stop the train. You might bet through. I mean, I do too, technically. Uh, Hopefully I spawn on either my train or the log cars. <laughs> we got, I do have the map open, so if it was gonna run too far, I could have, I could have stopped it. it. It has no power in it, like. Yeah, I basically around. only had two percent power on it. Oh, okay. But that hill, the hill be real. I was more or less trying to go slow before I got to the downhill part. Can't tell where I'm at, Chad. It's too hard to tell. Oh, it might work. Uh, let me 
one. Go. Parkour. Parkour. Oh, it worked. Ah, there it is. Parkour. Yeah, he was able to stop it really fast. Parkour. You could have jumped into Betsy and throttled it. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. It only took... Did you turn my cranes off when you ran by? Oh. I jumped on the cordwood. Oh, you're, uh... You might not be lined up correctly for the auto, too. Oh, but it, it works. This is maybe <laughs> auto? It'll work for one. Oh, that's and then it sad. Stops. That's yeah. sad. Oh, well. I'm not going to move my, uh... Not going to move me engine. Load a little manual here, it's fine. Oh yeah, I forgot about this too. I don't know if it's supposed to do this, but as soon as it drops, if you click the crane again, the crane will reset and then you can click again to grab another piece. So you can technically like load way faster. Yeah, I, I noticed that the other day. I'm like, oh. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have to wait for the crane to reset. It's kind of cheaty, but like, you know, it's fine. It'll be alright. Tomcat, what's up? It's Franny. By the way, Tomcat, I saw the picture Carson made me, or Carson pointed it out to me. The picture you posted in uh, Discord, we're just going to say that much. <laughs> From Rust. <laughs> it made me laugh, right? I'm 12 years old, leave me alone. I thought it was funny. Alright, let's grab some coal. As the train's like almost cold here. Shovel all the coal. Come on. 99, chat. Alright, let's go. I guess, speaking of other games, yep. have you seen the satisfactory update yet? Like what it looks like? No, no. It's uh, um, really good. Is it nice? Nice. It's also really dark. Oh. Hey, yeah, another dark like... game. Woo! Thanks for the uh, follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. How's it going? Excitement. John being, John being cheaty. I would never do that. You're right, Niles. What's going on, man? All right, where where are you guys going? Uh, I don't know. Okay. I'm doing my usual route. Okay. Uh, who's who's not on your engine? That black hat? Uh, yeah. Oh, dead. Dead. You want to throw that switch once he goes through there? Sure. And then I, I'm going the other way there, so... It's, you it's okay. To, uh, I, I will. <laughs> I think Trent spends more time not on his train when he's running the oh, train than he does... I'm used to on. not having the extension, so I have to, like, set my train low power the switch get back on the train uh, i don't i don't have the extension so i'm doing yeah, it the old-fashioned way don't either square nope there's no map in the top right corner oh. uh -uh. that switch is good uh, trent blow your whistle let's see if i can hear it from here ah. no, here. Go. that's good uh it's so loud. I think the worst part was last week, or was that Monday? When it was so loud. I think that was Monday. Anyway. That's cute. Sarge, <laughs> Sarge would blow the whistle and then laugh at me. Fishpun31 just resubscribed uh, for 53 months. Yeah. Rob, welcome back for 40 or 53 months. Sorry, 53 months. Rob, welcome back. Do appreciate the resub. How are you? Only reason why I say that because it looks like the pond's full. Oh, is the pond still full? All right. But yeah, the, the worst part was like Sarge would blow the whistle and then kind of chuckle. And I was like, come on now. Make my ears bleed over here. Okay, we are set to go back. Yeah, Freight Evo. Mm -hmm. The thing about right, this sar the sub and the sharks is shady, really? Why? Why is that shady? Everything about that sub is shady. I say, Rob, it's been a minute, buddy. 
Wait a minute. Glad to hear you're doing well and busy. And always a good thing to stay busy, right? The shrine sure. to the thirsty Betsy. <laughs> Don't worry, you'll, you'll use it eventually. Oh, no. Not if I go to my edge, because it's full of water. <laughs> I'll put, go put uh, some wood in it, make sure it's always uh, fueled up. It was breaking news on TikTok, and the guy has no proof. I mean, shocker, it's TikTok. What do you want? I mean, any news you hear on TikTok, you kind of have to take with, like, a grain of salt, in my opinion. I might repeat some of it, but like, doesn't mean I believe it all. A very yeah, large screen. Uh, well. Yeah. Uh, so one of you two is gonna have to stop here soon. Got your ab. Go up like it. Uh, train's gonna crash. Wait, where are you guys going? You, um, I was. I, be, thought, I thought. I thought I was nice. clear to come through here. I'll be the nice guy and uh, slow down. You were. Are you going to stop or just slow down? Are you going to run me over slow instead of like this? <laughs> Slowly run you over. <laughs> Bye, Chant. Oh, God. Uh, That's it? I'll let it. Let him, come on. Open it up. I was trying to be nice here. There it is. <laughs> it's not as bad. Stop, I don't want to hear it. It's not as bad since I turned it down. Carson, don't you don't hear it. hear it? Well, that's good. You mean to pipe my game sound Come through on, you? Mate. You can't park there, sir. That's right. Trent, you can't park there. Oh, Dave, thanks for the bits. Case. Okay, I didn't realize the pond's full then, huh? Yeah. Well, that's good. 100 out of 100. Okay. Um, <laughs> you can't park that. All right. Why? Well, that's actually not a bad thing, right? Question. Carson. Um, on Steam. On Steam. Um, uh, yeah, like the achievements uh, for farm Steam? Yes. Yeah, I, I, I see that. I thought it was desync. Is there a way you can, like, make it, like, show, like, a description of, like, how to I have a it? link for you. Okay. Don't look like, on the map, Sean. Kind of dumb. I don't want to know what you guys are doing. Don't look on the map. I don't want to know. Yeah. Carson, you got chat open, right? That's just the easiest place to send it. There you go. Uh, yeah, there's the. It, it actually gives you a description of what every achievement is. Because it's got like a little description under it, but it's like it has nothing to do with the achievement. Yeah. It's got. It's just something weird. Yep. Only two cars. Oh, Only first derailment cars. of the night, chat. <laughs> I don't even know what happened. I don't know how it happened either. We were. Whoever's keeping score, go ahead and mark that down on the bingo card. We have one uh, one uh, derailment of the night so far. Mark it down. The pit and ship it. Got to figure out how to use this new thing. The new Steam. They, they changed a lot with Steam, didn't they? True. Huh. Like, it's, it's altogether a different Good. beast now. Just saying. All right. Break, breaks would be lovely. I mean, they're 83%, but like, you know, this engine just doesn't care. It's like, brakes, what are those? It's a freight train. All right. So we are going to drop this core wood off. Actually, we're going to do a little train uh, uh, track rebuilding down here to get those other cars synced up. If y'all remember last time we played. Uh, we have some cheaty cars down here, so we don't have to actually unhook uh, this train anymore, which is very nice. But the cars need to be, like, hooked together that are down there, the cheaty cars. So to do that, I have to, like, build some track real quick, which is fine. Not a big deal. And then um, I might switch. I'll probably switch trains to my, my big American Flag engine. Actually, we might go on a run to the coal mine trap. We all might. Uh, just stay right there. Yeah. Because, uh, it'd be nice to get a load of coal. Alright. Hauled up yonder there. I really need to slow down. What's nice about having the besties at the end uh -huh. gone is... Nothing. This exact, this exact same reason. 
What's what's that? Oh, for when you derail. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I but guess. What was weird was we were kind of on the straight track. Were you going through a switch? Uh -uh. Sometimes switches get get a little crazy. I don't know why. We go forward somewhere. All right, here you go. Here go is the, oh, this is Sarge's train. All right. Yeah, pack backwards, I guess. Yeah. Forgot Sarge's engine was sitting down here at the shelter. That's good. You said how late? How late is late for Sarge? Do you think Trent? Or did he say? Uh, he just said uh, gonna be a little late tonight. Uh, pa pass that along to John. Thanks. Okay, that's fine. I saw he was playing Rust today. I thought about jumping in, but I uh, I just can't chill with Say you're right there, Black Hat. I want to try to get another one off. Yeah, I, I might take an engine too, eventually, and just go do some stuff for me. Yeah, no, let's do it. Let's get you an engine. Actually, I'll uh, join your company. You're, are you part of Trent's? I can leave Trent's. Leave Trent's, I'll join yours, because uh, I got Corwood I'm going to drop off here in a minute. All right, should be good. I'll, I'll build track first, though. I'll join yours. Yeah, we can get you some money. Okay. All right, uh, bring her forwards, I guess. Okay. Oh, that's going to be a problem. That, there's no... I have to just re-rail that, because the problem is when I go to delete this, it's going to... <laughs> yeah, bat. Low right. Fine. It's fine. Everything's fine, chat. We'll just pick this up and. Wait, can we uh, put half it? Half a car. That car? You used to be able to stack cars. I never did it, but you could. Which I always thought was kind of weird, but. I've seen YouTube videos where people stacked cars. Fun. And that's it. Alright, so the theory was that these GD tracks would look better if they were actually hooked up with the uh, the pass-through track here. So I guess in order to do that, I'm probably going to put a triple split uh, switch here on the center one. Up a ways right. here. Turn forward. Yeah, should work. Nope. Oh. Hopefully. Um. It's right. Some cars went flying. Oh man. Uh, nope. <laughs> Are you guys going through it tonight? Uh, that is desync. Oh Not no. Not the already derailed ones to play. Nope. Oh. Okay, I right. trust you. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are going through it. Or fast. Or something I mean, like you're. That. Pushing six cars right now. There we go. Yeah, no, there's just two off to my left here now that weren't there before. <laughs> and then most uh, of the down. time, this switch is going to be set this, or all, right, all the time. Good. Unless for some reason we have to move those cars, so this should work out just fine. Hopefully. Uh, you might be good right there. I'm going to try to get these rear. Rats. So you're telling me you don't see these ones over here, Trent? Uh, so where you're, you're standing? Yeah, there's a yeah. chance. There's nothing there. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh, can we get a server for this game? Because that would be lovely if they would do that, wouldn't it? Just saying. We would totally have one. Oh, they're gone now. Okay. Speaking of that, I don't have specifics right now in front of me, but uh, I've pretty much figured out everything I'm going to go with for the server PC. Nice. Figured out parts, stuff. Yeah, last night it was very techy. Last night in Team Duke was very techy, yeah. There was a lot of... I want to see the computer. Do what? I want to see the computer. I have to send you a link after stream. I don't have it on this computer. Or on a, you know... Yeah. Very, very techy though last night, man. We were we were comparing this processor to that processor or compared to this processor compared to what our current servers run on. Like through the company. In this case, or that case. Oh, we're gonna blow the company away though, for what what they run and what I'm gonna run. World of difference. 
Yeah, saying. Yeah, there's a certain point that the servers have to, server companies have to do. Uh, oh, yeah. What's I mean, practical? Yeah, no, I totally get it. I'm just saying, like, I didn't realize what they were running on, and then I started comparing it to what I was yeah, thinking I about, and I'm like, it's gonna be a night and day difference. That's good to hear. So, hopefully, and and I've actually figured out that. I'm not just gonna like stash it down in the basement because that's kind of wasteful. Uh, my dad needs kind of needs a new computer in a way, but all he does is watch YouTube and like. All right, slow it down. Pay a couple bills, right? Mm -hmm. Slow down, no so, breaks. So, might as well just let him use that PC. It's not gonna hurt. What our performance will be if his little bit of YouTube and stuff, you know. Shouldn't. Hurt. No, it won't. It won't. No, nah, I just. A small graphics card probably wouldn't be bad then. Onboard video. We're going with the K processor, so we got the onboard. Well, does that slow down the processor at all? Ah, uh, that I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I have to do some research. Okay. Because I'm actually not sure about that. But it'll only be like one monitor. And... Yeah. Yeah. I just I don't know how much using the onboard press the onboard graphics uh, two slows down two percent power. Yeah, I don't know actually. That's a good point. I, I haven't looked into that. Two percent can't get a moving trip. It was very very techy and uh, well, Just stay there then. I'll just move my. I'm I'm moving. It. All right. So basically, Chad, I'm just trying to hook these cars up, not to the train, but to each other. Come on. Come on. It's like the little engine that could here. You can do it. Yeah, that's what the Betsy's are doing right. Oh, I can I can push faster. I just don't want to derail everything in front of me. Well, lock, oh, the brake was locked. The brake was on. That's why it was going so slow. Brake was on. All right, you can probably just do no power. No power. Now we know, chat. Now we know. Yeah, and I, I mean, I could always slap a video card in if I could, or if I had to, you know. Going with yeah, plenty, just... plenty big power supply, and yeah, we're doing doing big things. As a, a cheap, just a cheap small one, if you just YouTube. Like a like a forty ninety Ti, you know. Yeah, just a small cheap one. Yeah, That's, yeah. Should be I'll, I'll buy it off Wish, so it'll be fine. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> you might get something then. <laughs> I, mean. I might get a brick in a box, but like. <laughs> Yo, John, what's going on, man? How you doing today? <laughs> yeah, yeah, Shade with his lemon uh, video card that he had for a while there. Or maybe still has? I'm not sure. The thing was all lemon, bro. The thing was not what it said it was. I'm pretty sure it was like a 480 or something. They said it was like a 3070 And they just recoded it to say. Yeah, it was bad. Flash the bios on it. Yep. That's why I'm always wary of like buying used graphics cards. I don't think I ever would. To be honest. I would depending on what I'm doing with it. Now fair play. Alright. Locked. Locked. Brakes are on. Chat, this is gonna this looks a whole lot better. I think anyway. Looking looking solid here, trap. All right. Wait, Jeff, what? But yeah, so that's that's the whole thing. So you're not wrong, Jeff. It is. I don't even know what that is. It's similar to Wish, but like, oh. like really cheap items. Even cheaper than Wish. Like ninety-three cents, stuff like that. Or like a forty-ninety. I don't know if they sell stuff like that. They, I've seen a lot of things on them. Oh, like they man. have like a Nintendo Switch for like seven dollars. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm I don't sure trust that's it. quality. Um, where's my? There you go. Shackle would be nice. All right, now we gotta go get the cars. So, just a question: What? So do you have to unload right at the core wood spot, or can you unload into those trailers? So the, or... the purpose of these cars, yeah, is so that I don't have to split my train and back in three cars at a time. So I can unload onto the first set, mm -hmm. and then unload those to the second set, and then unload those to the 
Yeah. It's actually okay. unloaded. Eventually keep the train together. Yeah, so it's basically going to be, uh, you're going to hop over, Although, basically. I might need to pull them up, actually. This might be too far. No, that should be okay. That one might be a little far back, but... Yeah, so basically you can just keep the train together, and if you have enough people, actually, we did it with three people uh, Monday, and like you just, it's awesome. It's it's really good. Okay. Almost like a slow roll. Yeah, and I actually do have this set up at the oh the oil refinery. Um, I think I still need to do some work on it because I I haven't had like the the piped all up there yet, but mm. I kind of have it set up there too. Oh, that has some. <laughs> uh, when you when you put the shackle in both, you know. Good job, John. I, and I you just need that third pin. Yeah, yeah. I need a pin between these two. Just don't hit any big bumps. Yeah, it'll it'll buff, right? Um. Yeah. Good try it. Yeah, black hat. Do you see the car rolling down in front of you? Nope. Cool. Why is there so much desync tonight? Like, I'm on fiber. It's, gosh. <laughs> so, I had internet issues the other day. I actually yeah. have had a couple rounds of internet issues lately. <laughs> Whatever, Trent. It's fine. My internet's fine. Uh, so can we get going forward and then I'm going to try to do this. We'll see if I can get this to work chat. Put the train at like 2%. Well, kind of if you're able to, you might be able to oh beat boy. Vaughn at the Great Depot. Chug, 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 chug. Oh, oh. Well, we don't need to haul any iron ore down tonight. We have 350 iron ore here, so... It's one of the six uh, telegraph offices. <laughs> yep. There's a lot of... You see, last time we played, we didn't have the extension at all. So we just... Every time we'd pass a switch, we'd put a telegraph office at it. Well, I was more or less talking to here at Freight Depot. Yeah, they're everywhere. There's one where me and Black Hat put Oop. one. One up the so, spawn track. The dual cars, by the way, the two set, like the two and the two, I think would be... Uh, handier if we had like people but i'm just gonna use the one set probably today because that's going slow enough i think it'll be okay plus it starts going uphill as soon as it gets to that switch so it'll slow down and my game's doing that again okay cool all right and then once you get the trigger here okay trigger trigger oh god we're gonna we're gonna overload things Chaos chat. There's a little chaos right now. Ah, oh, we made that happen. Look at, look at us. We're doing it, chat. We're really That's, doing it. It's an interesting thing that you can do with this game. I know, right? I I gotta remember seeing it in a video from like forever ago, and then I was like, I wonder if that still works. And then I just like set it up one day, and I was like, hot dog. I got dog. It works, chat. It works. You gotta get that trigger just right. Ready to do a uh, rapid fire here, Black Hat? Yeah. Gotta yes. be ready. So, oh, I forgot to join Black Hat's company. There. Now I'm part of Black Hat's company. Only missed a few bucks, I swear. Orwood's not really worth much down here. Only a couple dollars, I believe. See if the train's actually going a little slow now. Yeah, I don't know. 2% is going to make it up the hill. Although it's Somehow not even missed some okay. I need to push the train, chat. But if we had people, we could like do pull up two cars at a time, basically, and uh, do it that way. Probably work out quite well here. All right, we're up to four percent regulator on the train. Come on, come on, you can do it. I was thinking about it. Good thing is it's going through the uh, iron ore pretty good here, so. It's not like we have any extra ore wood down here. We're using it right away. Because after the stream Monday, 
I did finish loading that train of like the rail and beams or whatever and took that up and sold it for Trent so he could buy his engine. So yeah. That's nice of you. I know, right? What a nice guy. That were hell of a the life. first time ever. <laughs> <laughs> no, oh. sack it. God. It was nice uh, that one person that one time at that place. Blackhead, I'm going to probably just switch out these the, the T's for the Mechaboost. Uh, uh, God. Okay. I'm probably just going to stash these over at the spawn track. Oh, you like how Trent put the Betsy's back to back so that you can actually just stand there and control both of them? Yeah, I've seen that. Yeah, makes a lot of sense, actually. That was oh. pretty handy, actually, Black Cat, when I was trying to go up the hill. We'll have to keep that in mind next time we uh, restart. I'm sure we will at some point. Wait, wait, do we actually have extra core wood? No, we don't. Never mind. Still using it. Never mind. Come on, Trey. Okay, so maybe like 6%. Two percent's too slow. Four percent's definitely too slow. Still, six. And then actually, if we ever do fill this up with core wood, we could have you know four cars of core wood just sitting here ready to go, um, as well, which is cool. So, all right. You backing up to your uh, caboose truck uh, after I drop the Betsy's off at Spawn Track. Okay. Where are you guys at currently? You're at the depot, right? Mm -hmm. We are backing into the spawn track. Yeah, okay. uh, I can grab uh, the Betsy's. Grab the second switch. All right, let me know if you guys are going to be out on the main line. I'm on. I'm in route. Uh, by the time you get up here, we should be off. Well, I'm going back to the sawmill or the lumber camp. Oh, okay, I'm going to make sure the picture then. was gone. <laughs> is, that, is that what you were doing? I was. I was making sure. I was checking. Should be good, Trent. All right. Uh, do you have this? You know, there's Back just some things in life that I regret. All right. Here you go. Taking my hat off on stream might be one of them. Just throwing it out there. That's all right. I guess I'll meet you back at the cruise. So what I'm thinking, we have... What do we have on the map? We have three, like, good big engines, right? Mine, yours, and the uh, Sarge's. Sarge's. This one's okay, but I, I don't... It's not the best. What I'm thinking is we try to set up later a... Uh, our black heck it again, we could get a big engine. Uh... Oh, we, we make like a big run up to the uh, coal mine. We basically three. take a ton of rail. We take it. Are, it's already full of the beams. But like, you can always take more. And then maybe like, like maybe. It's, oh, dude. No, hold on. Two cars of rails. One car of lumber or beams or whatever it uses. And then one train of uh, like the coal cars to bring the coal out. That'd be cool. If you put a car of rails in, it's going to use those and the, and the wood. Then you put rail. Yeah, that would probably work. Yeah, I don't know if we... Hopper cars up front. Uh, hopper cars would have to be in the back. Because you'd want it to actually make coal to bring down. Because right now there is no, no coal up there. I know, but like more weight-wise. No, no, no. Well, on separate engines, you know. Oh, oh yeah. Say so you have 10 cars of rail. Which is a ton, but 10 cars of rail, 10 cars of whatever wood product it uses up there, and then 10 more cars of rail. And then uh, what? our 10 car, 10 uh, hopper cars. Yeah. That'd be pretty sick if we could get all that up there in one, one trip. I got a check on the back car here. Yeah, you need to go forward, so. This giant snake out of this yard. Problem is gonna be cars, I think, though. I got four or those... six oh seven. I don't know what I have. I can't check right now. I think I'm poor again. After buying those last uh, coal cars, I think I'm poor. But that's all right. 
It's all good. Maybe, uh, maybe Sunday night. If I'm not sleeping at the computer here, it would be a good time to jump on and just do some running. We'll see. Because the problem is we technically would need 30 of that one car if we're going to set that all up. Because that three products that are the same. Okay, yeah, so the back truck. Yeah, yeah, 30 of the one car. That would be a lot. The other problem is I don't know if there's actually room up there for, say, four trains, 40 cars plus engines. I'm not sure. I have a feeling probably not. But one way to figure out. Yeah. yeah, there's one way to figure out. There yeah. is a siding up there, so I did put that in at least the doubles part. Uh, Dave, we have not been able to find the bearing for the tractor. No, I haven't actually. I'm not really going to do any research on it, honestly, because if, if my dad can't find it in first time slash Chinese rocket debris, they can't find it. I'm going to say that it's like not a thing. Um, if anybody wants the numbers, uh, we have the Alice Jumper part number. We have the OD and the ID and the length. Um, I can post that stuff in Discord later if anybody actually wants to like, if they know a place that might have them that's local to them or something. I mean, I would be willing to pay for shipping and everything, you know, uh, if somebody wants to do that. But uh, I've got all the numbers here. I would be willing to post them later uh, if anybody actually wants to wants to do that. But otherwise, uh, yeah, I don't. If they can't find them, you know, Dad's been in the lawnmower business a long time and all that good stuff. So, like, you know, yeah, yeah. Would you be against putting a random one in there that works? A random, it? like a decent one for your bearing. Well, it's yes. it's it's a really odd bearing, honestly. It's a what do they call it? An open cage. It's a. Uh, like a roller bearing, but it's open okay. cage on the ends. It's kind of weird. Uh, kind of. But Dad can't come up with anything like anything close to it. So I think what we're going to do is we're just going to pack them with grease and put them back in there. So. My good black hat. Yeah, you got a car. They lasted a long time. They should last a little while longer. I got to start putting my tractor back together like soon, though. Because, uh, you know, August is coming up here soon. <laughs> I know it's like a month away, or not a month away, but like, you know, the farm show is in August. But that's not that far away, realistically, Good. you know. So, I got to get that tractor put back together soon. Nope, nope, come back. It right. snapped the, the shackle. Oh. Oh, no. All right, we're going for another uh, core wood real quick, uh, chat. I'm just going to solo roll this, no power. I think that's what did it. Another load of core wood, and then we'll work on uh, other stuff. Yeah. Uh, Varus, well, that's not at all what the bearing is. Uh, he found a bearing on Amazon. Okay. They've got all kinds of stuff, though. I mean, I, like I said, I assume, you know, if if Pops can't come up with it when it comes to, like, a part for a tractor or a lawnmower, I'm going to assume, and, and first time, uh, that it's just, like, not really much of a thing, you know? Maybe I should call up Agco and ask them. Yeah, so you might have to cross reference numbers. Like I said, we have like the we have the original tractor. Alice number, yeah. So it's weird that it's like the one piece that we've needed that the place that we buy all of our stuff for these Alice's they don't even think about having, you know? It's weird. Or or, or there's another place too. Neither neither uh, website has it, which is odd. They have so many other bits and bobs and pieces. But it is what it is. Honestly, it'll probably be, probably be fine because realistically, how many hours a year am I going to put on that tractor? Not a ton. 
Yeah. You just have to be basically just watch it if it gets super. Oh, I mean, if it grenades, then we know that. I know how to fix it. I know how to get to it anyway, you know? <laughs> True. Just make sure you get some extra other parts too, then. Yeah. Yeah. But Actually, but, oh, speaking of tractors see. grenading, um, oh, what was I going to say? Though, you, I'm sure some of you guys have heard of Bill's T Max on YouTube before, right? Yeah. Yeah. He, he, he was out driving a tractor around with his, he was driving Boris, his uh, Ford that has a flathead V8 in it. And uh, they did this like really long ride. Him and his like stepdad. His stepdad had a Massey Ferguson. And they did this really long ride. And right at the end of the video, spoiler in case anybody cares, if but you know, maybe just mute me for a second. Uh, he like blew up the rear end of that tractor. Oh, he's driving right. along, and all of a sudden you just hear clunk, 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 and I'm like, oh god. <laughs> it sounds right, so you want to switch the uh, bottom switch? Uh, uh, so you, lumber camp. So you go for logs instead of where I'm at. Yeah. Your switch already. You're good. Oh yeah, it was like clunk, 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 and I was like, oh god. That hurts. Like that hurt me knowing how much work that's gonna be to get to it and fix it. Oh man. Cause yeah, but no, yeah, I I gotta make the decision here real soon. Like we gotta just. We got to start putting the tractor back together. Like, that's all there is to it. If we don't start soon, we're not going to get the thing done for the show. That's kind of the goal is to take the tractor to the show and do some plowing. Not to mention, we have to, like, set the plow and stuff and shine the plow up. The plow is super rusty right now, so that's going to take some time, too. But that's just time out in the garden, you know, playing around. That's all that's going to be. I put my regulator at, or uh, did have it at eighteen percent, which was struggling. Yeah. Okay. Up to a or this, no problem. I can't imagine why, Trent. Drive right in there like it's nothing. Oh, hey, Trent. Hi. Oh God. Fancy seeing you here. <laughs> uh. Actually, you want to run my crates? One of you, Black Hat, you want to run my crates? Sure. Appreciate that. You can run both of us, right? Uh, really only going to be able to run one for a little. Well, I only until... got eight cars. I can wait. <laughs> Mine take forever to load anyway. Well, I don't know how far you go up to that switch, though. Oh, true. Yeah. I'll try to sneak out before Trent uh, gets up there. Or do you want to load my back there. cars in? What do you mean load very your back far, cars? Very far back cars, and I can keep backing up for you. Oh, oh that's true. Yeah. Oh, you can just back up and let me sneak out, too. It, it doesn't matter. Either way, it's all good. Or I'll just go back up. I'll just back down all the way to the smelter, okay? <laughs> Everything in reverse. <laughs> Call me Terry. <laughs> I'm putting it reverse, y'all. <laughs> uh, Vegas Bowl, uh, I could send you all the dimensions and stuff, or, or I guess you could look it up if you really want to look up. Uh, it, I got the Alice Job Report number if you really want it, uh, Vegas Bowl. For the record, shove her back just a little. Oh, yeah. It's all good, man. I've realized that these two tracks don't line up, and it kind of triggers me. Have you guys ever noticed it? Oh, where the bridges are? No. The angle of, like, the track where I'm sitting and the track where Trent's, they don't, they're not the same angles. Oh, oh. yeah, especially if you look on the map. It's really... Yeah. <laughs> your, your track is... Well, even your track's not even square to no, the platform. No, nothing's square to the platform. Your track's not square to the platform at all. Well, <laughs> at least square. where my train is, not the second platform. <laughs> uh, I like the way the rest of this turned out, but like, ugh. 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 Yeah, it's Triggering. nothing square up here for the two yards. 
stopped. Okay, I'm assuming I need to move by now. Oh, wow, it just stopped. Okay. Just, just stopped, yeah. All right. Well, it's not nice to uh, your camera views right there, John, because I can watch my train. <laughs> you have all the free time. Well, Vegas Bowl, it is an Alice Chauber. Two zero six five five zero or five five. Is that a zero or I guess that's a it's a, we're going to say that's a zero, not a D. I don't know. I think it's a zero. Well, we're going to go with a zero. OK, two zero six five five zero. OK. That's the part number from Alice Chalmers, apparently. Well, how that one crane is still running. Is that good or uh, should we get it there? Okay, I was like, I could not tell. What about me? Where am I? Stand by. Uh, hold on. Uh, hey, uh, you're somewhere. What's going on? Welcome in. Welcome in. How's it going? Just continue automated. Yes. Nice. Very, very nice. All right, it's time for a water refill trap. We're loading oh, up the I core gotta, wood. Got to put fuel in mine. I meant in, like, in my green cup. <laughs> this train is its down to less than 800 water, so I don't think we're going to be running this train a ton tonight because this train, I don't know if it would make it up to the coal mine. It might, but I don't know what you'd pull with it. You know, like empty cars? But not yeah, cool. That, Come back that, oh, that tender only. Yeah. It's, it's, we just, we'll take the engine along for emotional support. How about that? Put it at the very front <laughs> or the very back. I could, I could pin the controls with my engine or something. I don't know. Something like that. Actually, how much money do I have? I have $3,000. I'm like low key kind of rich in this game right now. Or something. Oh, this will work out great, actually. This trend's out of my way now. Or almost out I was of my saying, way. I'll load the back Come cars back first. Yeah, and I got two more cars to load still, so we're fine. And good right there. Totally fine. I think, at least. I think I'm. Oh, yes. I think I'm full. I think I'm full. I'm not sure. It's so hard to tell. I'm telling you, there needs to be like a camera system we could set up that would pop up in the top left of your screen or something. <laughs> Obviously not 1800s technology, but like, man, could you imagine how handy that would be? That would be really nice. Can somebody make a mod for this game? Plugger. <laughs> We need a camera system mod that when you get close, it pops up over there. I can't tell by cat. I uh, keep on going. All right. I know some people use like foundations to mark the ground and stuff. Maybe we should start doing that. Stop right there. If All you right. can. Yep. You betcha. We will try this. <laughs> Plugger, I'm, I was saying that like. You know, I can't tell from here if my cars are lined up back there, right? Back. So I think it would be really, really cool. Just imagine this. In this game, if there was a camera system that we could deploy, or every every loading platform would just have a camera, say, like, right here. Right? And then when you get close, when you're driving your engine, it would just, like, pop up in, like, a picture-in-picture -picture kind of thing in the top left of your screen. Or you could move it even, too. I think that would be super cool. There he is. So you can like, you know, see your, you know what I mean? Yeah. See your car, see how close you are. I think that would be super cool. Uh, uh, I don't, maybe. Might have to come back a little bit. I don't know if it's possible, but like it would be super handy. Obviously not in 1800s technology. I understand that. But, you know. Should be good right there, Trent. Mine too. <laughs> That's all. That's all I have to say. Uh, I don't even know if it's possible to make mods for this game. I have no idea. I mean, somehow they got the extension to work, but beyond that, I have no clue. I do think that'd be cool, though. You know, just saying. Although we've also talked about, like, having a game start at this time period, but, like, somehow you progress through every time and you get newer engines and newer cars, and that would be cool, too. Starting with a hand cart. 
<laughs> we started with the hand card. Now we're here. Or something. Oh, that would be funny. I think I'm full, right? Um, Pretty sure. Yeah. All right, we out of here. User joined your channel. Hi, Trent. Bye. It is handy that you the way you loaded your cars. Leonard, what's up? Okay, come back. What's hey, up? hey, if you get more rain tonight, sir. So, we're gonna have to throw hands soon, okay? East of town got seven inches last night. Oh yesterday. <laughs> I know they got rain, but like seven inches. That would be tied for the biggest rain I've seen ever in my life at one time. <laughs> Golly, man. And they've pretty much taken our rain out of our forecast for Sunday now. So, really? yeah, real happy about that. Next chance of rain's like next Friday now. So. I think tomorrow's our last chance for a few days. For a few days. No. <laughs> I'm going to have to water my yard on Sunday. I think we're, I think I'm going to be clear tonight. Okay. Yeah, they, they backed it down for me. I was supposed to get 50% now that it's 40. I think we're at 10. Non-stop. Just, you know. That, that's Saturday for me. Living in the desert now, you know? <laughs> trees are still green. Although they were talking about trees on the news today. Like, you might want to water your trees. Don't worry about watering your grass, but water your trees. Oh, yeah, it's a thing. Which I have one tree left on this whole in this whole yard. There's one tree. I, I need to water it because it was mom's favorite tree. So you know, gotta water that. We'll take a hose out there and crack it. Let it lay for a couple hours. You know. Should we go through a trap? Right. I swear, some people Steam names that I didn't know were on my friends list on Steam that keep popping up on my left screen. <laughs> I'll add anybody, apparently, to Steam. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, bye, guys. Have a good time. Bye. Bye. -bye. <laughs> uh, how much money do you have, Trent? Or are you poor again? I am. Let me get him. I have six on six hundred and seven dollars. Oh, okay, you're poor. All right. I can buy one car. All right. You betcha. Basically, you're poor. Yeah, uh, pretty much. Yeah. All right. That Just has been the, uh... been a very common theme so far in this like map for us. We've just not had any money. I don't know if it's because we're all working for like our own companies trying to earn money or like because I don't know. Just haven't played as much yet. I, I don't. It seems like normally when we play though, there's just like we have so much money and engines everywhere, cars everywhere. And it's like, oh, you want a $10,000 engine? Sure. Or, or whatever. You know, $6,000. No big deal. So, kind of interesting. Uh, where are you guys heading with those logs? Uh, freight depot. Okay, I'll throw the switch behind me so you can just chooch on from where you're at. Since I'm running down to the smelter again. Chooch on. Nope. My one problem with these cranes, we'll say. Huh? They don't line they don't. up to these cars. Nope, oh. they don't have a handle to actually crank them. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. I was thinking about that a while back when I was playing this game. I was like, how do they, how would they turn these? I assume, yeah, there'd be like a big handle sticking off there. And I, Well, I would actually assume there's another gear that's missing. It could be, too. Well, even Black Cat, if you pay attention to the little wheel there, they didn't put the, the texture or the color right where it kind of lays with the gears oh. there. There's more updates coming. Don't worry, the game's not done yet. Like, watch the wheel as it spins. You'll feel a little bit of a difference. Look up, come back. Maybe it's not as sun faded, Trent. 
Or maybe it's more sun faded. I don't know. Like they didn't even oh, paint I... the, uh, the one part. It could be. Well, for me, like, where, like, it sits down in the track or whatever, it's just yeah. black. Yeah, there's, like, no color to it. Interesting. Very, very interesting. So where's my other, where's my engine, my big engine? Is that back of the depot? I think in the depot. Yeah, the, the, the flags. Yeah, flags, yeah. Yeah, it's still in the, uh, the rail yard with the cars on it. Okay. I gotcha. So we need like a, a lot more okay. of those cars. At least 10 more. Would be lovely. I love it. We go from like all the regulator to, you know, eh, we should probably think about some brakes, you know? And none? Uh, probably think about some brakes. Like 90%. Where'd you go, Trent? And it's not slowing down. That's the concerning thing about this engine. 90% brakes, eight cars of car wood, and we're not slowing down going down this grade. It's not an issue. No, not at all. It's not an issue until you have to put the regular. Until reverse. it is, yeah. Then it's then it's an issue. Sure. All right, fine. I'm getting comfortable to this run where I, I'm think I feel like I'm making this run a whole lot faster uh, than I have been in the past. I've done this run a few times now, anyway. Just a smidge bit. So yeah. And off the regulator again. Dive downhill. So if we bring a load of coal down from the coal mine, that goes to, was it the ironworks? Pretty sure that's what that's called. So we'll need the iron stuff there too, eventually. But it's all good. Then we can get some tools. We can sell tools, man. Tools are worth money. Or some good money. Like, they're pain to make. Pain to load. Well, it used to be really a pain to load because each car holds 100, I think, those box cars. And you used to have to load them manually one at a time before the auto cranes were a thing. So, like, yeah, that was always a nightmare. That sounds so... Painful, yeah. Yeah. So now with the, where you just click it once and go, it's so much better. It just takes forever. I think it's 100. I can't remember. Sarge has messed with the box cars a lot more than I have, so. Ask him when he shows up. All right, so this should give us plenty of stuff here at the smelter for a little while anyway. Hopefully. I go ahead and loop all the way around right now because I don't feel like throwing switches. Doesn't matter which way you go first, honestly. So. Go ahead and run around. This should give us some extra core wood down here too, which is nice. Because these were full already when we left last time, so... We should have some extra stuff. Which is not a bad thing. Bad thing at all. Yeah. Basically full. 92. I guess that 95. That's hard to tell when you're moving. It's more blurry. Yeah, so we'll run around. Get to the other side. Hopefully this engine can do this. It's not that steep here. Little bit, but it's not that bad. I think I like the quieter uh, sound effects. What do y'all think, chat? The only reason I have to do is for the engine that Trent and Sarge have. Whistle so loud. Painfully loud.
You guys at the depot yet? Or no? Maybe not. Now we start going downhill, we'll coast in a little bit. Probably won't need as much regulator because this is going to be flat going out this way for this time for the train, so that's good. And we'll use the new cars on the, uh, the setup here for unloading the core wood. Yeah, this, this looks good. I like this now. It's going to work good. And if we ever need those cars or something, we can always back in and hook to them. I don't think we will, but we could. There's actually three extra core wood here. Wow. One, stop. Hit trend, stop. Yeah, I did. I, I, I saw it. Okay. What happened? You guys Same do thing. How? How do you keep derailing in that one spot? A oh, different spot this time. Oh, different spot? Okay. Well, that's good. A little bit farther down the line, and the, we just, have the caboose and five cars on there. Is it just like a, a top speed issue, or? I don't think what's so. The, what's the deal? Because we weren't going that fast this time. I only had like 18% on the reg. But you're, and you're basically on like flatland, or are you going downhill? Uh, right for the sawmill. Oh. That's weird. That's basically flat. On train. Come on. Have you sat on regulator? All right, chaos is going to ensue. Let's go. <laughs> I don't know why you keep derailing, though. That's weird. Something with those cars, maybe? Maybe. I mean, they've been pretty good for you, though. You've run a ton of loads with those cars so far. We're doing that again. All right. That's weird. So, mark that down as two now on the derail counter chat. <laughs> How many cars this time? Five? Uh, there is... My wood cars and the caboose on the track. Yeah. And. Seven derailed. Seven derailed total. Nope. Not bad. You're bumping me. At least they fixed the issue uh, with the derailing cars, Stay like forwards. basically crash and multiplayer, right? Yeah. Because that was really annoying back when that was a thing. Yeah, this is efficient. I like I like this whole setup here. I'm just getting that trigger is a little weird, but I'm liking this. Actually, if you get it going right, you can just walk away and watch it unload across the hall three. Uh, your timing right <laughs> yeah all right 63 out of 100 so that'll get us oh that'll get us some stuff yeah and there's still 316 on the the ore so i would say we are in really uh good shape yeah the way that you came in is probably the best way to come in yeah because you're you're not fighting the hill trying to Run your slow regulator, right? Especially for a single person. Yeah. Okay, right. come back trip. Well, I'm going to park this train down here by Sarge's. Because I think we're good on core wood right now, and I don't really feel like running a third load right away, so. Uh, so far, you're clear, but we'll probably be clear by the tracks oh, I'm, by this time. I'm going to be switching the other train. Yeah, I'm going to ditch this one down here for now. No point in taking this one to the freight yard because it doesn't really need to go to the freight yard. 
We'll just uh, chuck it over here by Sarge's. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. If I put these tracks in down here, I'm like, well, you never know. We might need to park some trains, so. Might as well Everywhere. have some capabilities to doing this, you know? Okay. You're good to go forwards again. Got three left? Yep. All right, I'm going to pull forward so we can try to get all three. Throw the switch behind us just to keep anybody from driving in here by accident. And we'll park the train here if it stops rolling. It'll think about it. Add right. your regulator, too? Yeah. All right, do you guys need help? Uh, if you want. All right, what do you need? I'm here. It's just like explode here. Is that what happened? Uh, uh huh. This time, or yeah, this time it happened there. The first time was on the main line. But well, it was on the other side of the switch, right? Yeah. And basically next to the telegraph office up there. Wow. Because where I stopped was on the switch. Okay. That is, uh, that is weird. All right, I got a pin shackle here. Uh, go ahead, go ahead and bring it on back. Slow roll. You gotta go pretty far, so. Just keep on swimming. Got two more. I think, two it, more. I think it connect by the sound. I, I love the sound. So good. But you have to walk past it. What do you mean? That's all you hear when you walk past a train. Oh, is it? I don't hear it. You think in multiplayer thing? Are there brakes on back here or no? Uh, maybe. Oh, these cars, aren't, these cars aren't shackled, by the way. We'll need you to hook and then pull forward, Trent. So yeah, pull forward now. There ain't nothing here. All right, you can come back. The rest of these all hooked up, yeah. Uh. I was just checking that because I thought that one was hooked up too. One more, Trent. Three feet. on a dime. <laughs> Alright, that's all hooked. I think you're all hooked up. Okay. Go ahead and give it the old uh, tug test. See? Oh, your caboose is unhooked. No. Not the caboose, Trent. Oh no. Oh, that, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't question it. Yeah, go ahead, Trent. Yep, you're totally hooked up. Everything looks fine. You put a zip tie in there, Black Cat? Is that one that's going on there? <laughs> yeah, a couple, a couple of those uh, clear zip ties. Clear zip ties. Oh, only the finest of zip ties, the clear ones. The best ones. All right, I got to find my train chat. Where's it at? I don't know. Uh, on the other rails, basically. It's this one right here. Uh, other depot or other uh, teleport. I, I I got run mode on. I'm cheating. It's fine. All right. So I'm not going to have. Yeah, it's not worth. How much money are you up to, Black Ant? Uh, 3,150. Oh, man. We're all poor. <laughs> Uh, what, what cars are we trying to get? Uh, ideally more of these that haul like, uh, uh, what's it called? Beams and beams and things. lumber and rail and all that. Yeah. What? You actually able to buy some? No. Oh no. Uh, which way are you guys set to come in here? Uh. They'd be able to go in. Oh, yeah. Uh, You're going to straight switch. to the depot. Yeah, you guys are fine. Okay. Uh, No, actually, you want to go there. Okay. Now you're going straight to the depot. All right. I'm going to pull up a little bit, but I'm not going to, like, I won't be in your way. Okay. I think I was able to buy two cars. 
Rip. Now I'm at a 107. Man. <laughs> What's up, Carson? So I set uh, my small little harvester and my small little tractor first by auto drive. Yeah. I run to the bank and I went and picked up dinner. Yep. You know, got, got Sonic. Of course you did. Is that the new Taco Bell now all of a sudden or what? I had Taco Bell for lunch yesterday. Oh, it's like the new meta, huh? And then I've had, I had Taco, I had McDonald's yesterday and today too. Arson's living the uh, high sodium life right now. So I went to Sonic today for dinner. I got mozzarella sticks and a Red Bull slush. That's your dinner? Yep. <laughs> The dinner of champions. Right All right, so we need man. to have a talk later, buddy. <laughs> oh man. Man, what a read you, bud. My parents are out of town, and my brother's gone. So like. Oh really? Dude. I didn't know yeah. that. Oh, uh, Betsy's are gonna have to get. Oh, I've got track. a story for you, Johnny. Yeah, I mean, I've got, story a, life, I've got a life update for you. I'm really okay. Uh, say black hat, I should be able to Not right now, huh? manage these. Not right now. No. I, got, I got the buzzers. Right, I'll you. be here all night though now, but... Something That's... went flying, but I'm not sure what it was. Oh, it's the map moving around. That's all. <laughs> That's <laughs> like, um... I don't see anything flying. Well, because technically when you go to look at, like, the, the cars, your character teleports. Mm -hmm. And so, like, the map, like... Teleported. It was a whole thing. Uh, uh, is there six cars there right now? I believe there is, right? Only one. Uh, watch oh, those Betsy's. My engine's in front of that. Betsy's going to gonna hook it up for you. Why is the Betsy running that way then? Betsy, come back. <laughs> Betsy, come back. You can blame it all on me. <laughs> Not gonna lie, Sonic's made me mad now. Uh, Black, how you can come I've back? Won. Interesting, Dwigger's pull. Interesting. I got you, man. I got you. So this is right. six. Um, I'll be able to buy more. So bring it all back. Who's in? Who's driving? Is that Trent? Hi. That's that's Black Cat. Okay. I was like, where's Betsy going? Betsy's leaving. Betsy's about to uh, leave the chat. I come in, into the middle. Or... No, it's nope. going to this side right here where I'm, or that side. This side, yeah, that side. I was looking at it wrong. It's going to the me... water tower side, Trent. Or water tower middle and then left. I don't know. Is there shackles in this thing? Yep. On Betsy's, there's not. I wasn't doing Betsy's. <laughs> what about here? Okay, you got this. All right, bring it on back. Let's go. We got this. Good old Betsy. I like that you turned the light on too, by the way. <laughs> yeah, because it was at the, at the rear. Oh, or it actually was. was. Yeah, okay, true. It would have been the, uh, what do they call that? The end of train, like, end, red light they end, have these days, yeah. Uh, end of train device. Yeah, why, don't you have, um, why don't you have the day-night cycle on? Uh, so last time we tried that, we crashed the game. Also, but, we, uh changed different seasons. But I also don't know. I think it was actually because of the extension that we crashed, not because of that. All right, you're good. You guys throw those pins in so early. It just looks goofy. Oh. <laughs> you got stuff to do and places well. to be. <laughs> I mean, I agree, but... I, I'm just hoping I get boiler pressure back before I run out. Uh, So just pull forward, and then you'll come straight back on the same, uh, the same thing, okay? I'm going to buy more cars. Well, you also have another Betsy that you can uh, take advantage of. I know. Hey, don't. That sounds weird. Don't say that. <laughs> We're not taking advantage of anybody. Gosh. Hooligans, chat. Hooligans. So if you're going to buy more, I'll put a shack on pin on this. That's what I'm saying. Just just have him, like, you'll just come back on the same, on the oh, same track. Uh, come back. Wait, hang on. No, I can buy one more, oh, but like... Hold on. Locked. There we go. Nine. So that's uh, eight, right? Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You betcha. How's that boiler pressure coming? We're good. <laughs> well, 
Oh, this Betsy. Oh, this Betsy's out of water, guys. Which, which one? I don't need it. The, the, the black one, the, the bigger porter. Oh, it's out of everything. It's out of yeah, everything. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> All right, cut, bring it on back. It's just there for the light. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, it's out of everything. It's. Well, whenever we get done switching, we can put it underneath the water tower and set and forget. Right. Wow. So ideally, we need two more still. And you're good. And I will have the money for that. So just pull forward again. We'll do two more. Been trying to get to 10 here. Pull that, yeah. Might need you to, yeah. There you go, Trent. Vacate the track as well. Oh, I was just trying to get to the uh, tackle stuff. All right. All right, that's good. All right, they've all been purchased. Didn't think I was going to have enough funds, but like, I still have $996. Chat, we're rich. Not actually, but like, you know, kind of. Not really. Uh, can, are you able to throw the brakes on that? Brakes are on on here, yeah. No, I'm on or off? I guess that answers that question. I usually leave them on until it's hooked. At least for the back car here. That sidewalk back there is not very uh, forgiving, you know? Got like half a car yet. Or is that engine out of water too? I have 250 water. It's just the problem of getting moving. 250 water. That's not a lot. I think these things only hold like 400. Uh, yeah, I guess so. I don't know. Basically, the big engine's holding like 5,000. Uh, no, I'll keep coming. We got a ways to go. We're coming. Are you going to be able to handle all 10 of these just on flat ground? <laughs> It's hey, not what, good. Little Betsy was able to handle 12. Hang on. Uh, keep, keep her coming. I wonder if when I got in this thing that I accidentally put the the brake on. All right, you're good. Pull up. Where's the brake in this engine? What's, where's it actually at here? Uh, far right. No. That one? No, that's her... I bet that's what it was. I had the, uh, the brake technically on. Because I jumped into the controls, so it would have auto... Yeah, the brake was on. That's why. Uh, moves, I can move, move pretty good now. Moves a lot better now, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> or maybe not. <laughs> oh, I like, took off a lot already. Oh, later. crank it up. Reverse idler... Gotcha, Vegas Bull. Gotcha, man. Interesting. All right, you probably fit no uh, no power. One car. And back reverse, right. reverse, reverse. <laughs> so then, Trent, you want to hook up your train to this? I can, yeah. Okay, and we'll go. Uh, Probably, I don't even know. We'll have to figure it. Hang on. I can tab out real quick. Uh, uh, the fir first car that you're going to back into, John, has a shackle. I'm tabbed out. Uh, let's see. Show info. Okay, so if you guys bring uh, beams, how about that? Wooden beams, 30 of them is what the thing holds. It is technically full, but I'll take rail, a whole train of rail. And then, um, where beams, if I do the rail first, so if I go up the hill first and I unload and then it'll make room for the beams that you guys are going to bring. That makes sense. Yep. Okay. So we need to work on getting your engine, uh, unhooked. Well, park your cars out of the way somewhere, Trent unhooked. And then over here, my engine is in the way right now though. So there is that. Unless you just like, well, no, it's in the way. Because you have to go turn around, too. 
So you want to start working on that. I can move my engine up if you want me to. Uh, here in a minute. We'll get these cars hooked up. All right, keep going, Black Hat. Yeah, Vegas Ball, I think it's just like one of those things. Ah. That... What? <laughs> oh, I didn't even look at that track. I got attacked by a caboose. <laughs> Wait, what'd you do? You re-railing your caboose? Oh, you're going to put it on uh, here, aren't you? Okay. That just Keep going. Me a got like a whole there. car. Yeah, just hold on. I don't know if I'm connected anymore. Did it? Hit you? No, on my screen, yes, yes, it did. And <laughs> now you're in the caboose. Wow. Oh. <laughs> I think my life just flashed before my eyes. Uh, two so far, Sean. All right, you are good. And they were all pure accidents too, Sean. Uh huh. Uh, <laughs> no, they were freak accidents. They just like happened. Yeah. I don't think speed was an issue because, well, at least I hope not. I don't know. There's really. I know for sure the second one wasn't. The NTSB has not investigated yet, so. Well, if you could please uh, put the caboose on the back, please. Yeah, we'll get there. Yeah. Alright, I will tab out and pull my train up out of the way as well. Caboose? Somebody's in the caboose right now. Yeah, it's you. Oh, oh I got kidnapped? Yeah, you're in the caboose. Oh. So, John, when you go by the caboose... Uh... Why are you in the caboose? That's what it shows for me, is it's oh. my cat. Oh, it shows me in there, too. Um, It could be... Imposter. Could be Vigorous Bull. <laughs> oh, yeah, you guys. Somebody is in the caboose. Mm -hmm. That's creepy, dude. That's creepy. All right, you're good to uh, back up, by the way. Um, the good thing it doesn't follow you as you go past. Yeah, yeah the <laughs> eyes, the eyes follow you. Oh God. Or even the body that'd turns. Even, that'd make it even better. I think I would body log out and be done. The body turns as you go past. I don't think I'd play anymore. What's that weird thing up in one of the fields? And you click on debug, corner for one. Uh, it's part of it's messed up. It's an auto drive thing. Uh, you can turn it off. I forget how, though. The Man in the Caboose. That's the name of the next, like, big horror film, right? It is now. <laughs> Comes out Friday the 13th. The Man in the Caboose. Well, you're coming in awful hot. That's okay. That's fine. Ew. Half a car. Touchdown. Touchdown. Oh, hey. Oh, God. I got to stop my engine. It's running away. Brakes. <laughs> it's up at the big Y already. Oh. I didn't oh. mean for it to go that far. <laughs> Just so it's, it's essentially at the uh, sawmill. Though. It is clear. No, not quite that far yet. It's at the first Y, not the second Y. Oh, the uh, oil mill. Yeah, the oil refinery. Yeah, that, that thing. That Y. The man. Oh, it is. It is. It is Black Cat. It has a name. Yeah, he he stole me somehow. The man in the caboose stares out longingly. Nothing weird about this chat. Nothing at all. These cars are, you are able a little to heavy. You think? Back all the way into the siding, or? Who? Black Cat. Well, Trent, you, you just need to no. You need to stay up out of the way right now, because he's gonna have to drive the Betsy's out. You oh, I don't know if there's enough room for him to no. back all the way in or no. Mm -mm. Not with all these cars, no. We probably should make it where there's enough, but no, not right now. So you go pull up past the next one. We'll hook up the caboose, and then we'll unhook the Betsy's, and then we can put the Betsy's over by the uh, freight depot, like by the water tower, maybe somewhere over there. Little bit more. Almost there. All right. Bring it on back. Oh, throw it in reverse, Terry. 
I'm what? giving her all she gets. Uh, soft right before your train. What am I doing on stream tomorrow to celebrate the Cards Cubs on uh, from England? I am uh, going to sweat a lot because it's going to be hot in here. That's what I'm doing. Vegas Bowl, uh, uh, scroll up in Discord. I posted a picture of him uh, a while back. I can post it again if you want. All right, you are hooked and booked and ready to roll. Yep. Can you roll or no? <laughs> Fire it up. Let's, I'll unhook it before you go too far. We'll figure out. All right, cool. I'm just going to unhook it because, you know. Hey, bye. <laughs> Are you looking for the gears? We're looking for the... It's a bearing. Let me I, let me post it again. I'll post the same photo. Black Cat, I got you railed into the uh, firewood side. All right, stand by. One to know it's... Okay, so in this picture I'm posting, it's the two on the right is what we're looking for. The two Fire on the right. Up. That post. The two on the right, chat. That's what we're looking for. The other one, the big one, I think Dad can find that. That's right. like a standard bearing. Put it in reverse. Put it in reverse, tear. Don't you soak, when, she, when you take some part like that with bearings, don't you soak them in um, WD 40 to clean them? Uh, you can. Uh, they were actually pretty clean. Uh, they were up out of the water Ooh. in the transmission, you see. They weren't actually down in the, um, the water. And uh, even John, the are you, stuff are you that... Able to switch that one switch? Which one? Oh, out here? I can, I can grab it. Uh, even the ones that were down in the oily water nastiness, they actually weren't bad. Like, they turned out a lot better than we thought they were going to. Like, the gears look really good. I don't know that my track, but the thing with the, with the B, the, the tractor that we have there, it didn't have a lot of hard hours on it. It was a mowing tractor. It, I don't know that it's ever been hooked to like a plow, you know? I mean, not that it's a big tractor or anything, but. When was the last time you guys had your plow out, like the plow, or do you guys even have one? Like plow in general? Yeah. At the farm, it's been a few years. We plowed. We, we. We like Don't you doing just it. use the big disc to do the pumpkin area? Uh, yeah, mostly we just use the field cultivator now. Actually, well, we use the disc at first. Chop up the vines. The actually, the vine. actually, the first thing we do Why is we go out, we go out there with the lawnmower and we mow them first. You and, send the gravely or the laser? Uh, last year I used the gravely. Most of the time we use the X Park though. Build laser. Oh, Trent, you got. Bring it back. You're good. Uh, but last year, yeah, I used the I used the grave layer. And I pushed all the pumpkins out of the way first and then chopped up the vines. And then we. Uh... Oh, Trent, that was you didn't even touch the car, Trent. <laughs> Trent was ready to go, y'all. Oh, man. All right. I'm going to go jump on my train and head down where I'm going. Okay. God. Chat, that's why I turned my sounds down right there. Oh, man. All right. So y'all are bringing beams, right? Isn't that what I told you all? Yep. All right. Uh, give me two seconds. Don't run me over, okay? 20%. I just got to go throw my switch real quick on this thing. I'm 100. Get out of here. And Vegas Bowl, if you're looking for videos of, like, people working on the tractors, uh, JPN, I forget what the rest of his channel is, but it's JPN something. There's some numbers after that. That's the guy that we've been watching work on his tractor. So, yeah. Got a lot of really good videos. I want to say it's JPN like 76 or 57 or something. I don't know. All right, Trent, you're uh, this 
wishes are all set. Ready, thank you, and I felt that. <laughs> you felt me tab out and change switches? There's a little hiccup there. That's who you're watching. He's got a lot of really good videos. I've watched pretty much all of his videos when it comes to the, the tractor stuff. So, yeah. Uh, that's a question for first time. Or Carson, who actually made this game? I don't actually know. What'd you say? Who made the game? What's the company name? What game? Uh, Railroads Online. I actually don't know. I know that it was started by like a guy. That's all I can tell you. Our our uh, various uh, Bull Hill Google. Stefan Klingberger. Is there a company name? That's just the ve developer. No, oh, just the guy. Publishers, Estragon Entertainment. Yeah, they did partner with Estragon, yeah. Which is so the same one that does uh, uh, construction sim. No badge. So there's not a company name, it's just like a person. Interesting. <laughs> very, very interesting. But it's a really fun game. I uh, enjoy it quite a bit. It's a good time. It is a good time. Right. October 1st, 21. Wow. And there's the page if you want it. That's a really, uh, it's a really fun game. It is a good time. So the cool thing is you get to lay out all your track and, um, all that stuff. You get to do it all yourself, which is pretty cool. Um, so you can do it however you want, basically. Um, I can end the game. Uh, yeah, you can do it however you want. So if you want to set up, you know, crazy floating bridges, you can do that. Or if you don't want to do that, you don't have to. It's pretty cool. And the track lane is so much better than it used to be. When this game first came out, the track lane was just like one of the most awkward things of all time. And it is so much better now. Yeah, exactly, Chuck. There's yeah, the trees are holding up the bridge. Yeah, it's like you know when we were when you were a kid and you built a tree house, right? Same concept. <laughs> it's just a couple two buff. You know, you know, Chad. I fell out of a tree house one time. I thought I was gonna have to go to the hospital. I uh, I had a bungee cord and I was really dumb and I was sitting on the. I've told this story a million times. But whatever. I was sitting on the, the floor of the treehouse with my legs dangling over the edge. And for some reason, I had an old rotten bungee cord. And I had it going, like, from post to post of the treehouse. We had a sick treehouse for a while. Like, it was huge. Okay? Dad went, like, crazy with this treehouse. Actually, kind of even had, like, a, a little bit of, like, two stories. Kind of. It was pretty sick. But anyway, so... Um... Yeah, uh, I was like, I had this bungee strap going across there and I was like, it was going across my like chest and I was leaning, leaning forward. Really dumb. Uh, the bungee strap uh, broke and uh, I wasn't holding on or nothing. I was just using the bungee to hold me in the tree, you know? And uh, dude, down I went, I landed like straight on my face. And uh, the, the only injury I really had was a bruise from the bungee strap and it went from like, you know, We'll just say side to side across my chest. It was really awkward, but man, I was kind of sore after that, you know? That was not fun. Just saying. You tried Railway Empire 2 and it was annoying to do the track. You know, it's actually a game I haven't tried yet, but here, I'll show you really fast. Let me stop my train and I will show you how to build, or show you how the track lane is. Uh, so basically, you open it up here and you have basically different amounts of underlayment the gravel i always go with the third just because you know if you have a little valley or something it kind of helps but basically you can click and it's hard to tell up there because you know let me go somewhere where there's no track 
so it's easier to see with them without the, the map getting in the way up there uh the map is a, a kind of a mod uh, for the record it's not actually part of the base game uh but basically you can click and then you can rotate um you can rotate your track actually here let's click out of it first hang on here we go so we're gonna first set our our angle and you can adjust so i have mine going by tens you can go down all the way down to one or up to 100 so if we want say 329 that's the angle we're gonna go with uh we can lock in at that angle um we so we have a perfectly straight track you can go down with a grade all the way up to 10 if you wanted to or up to a 10 if you wanted to it's like 10 percent up or down uh lock it in flat and then you can use it's all numpad and controls for this which is very interesting but we can lock in like a certain radius uh you know so you can lock in say okay i want a 100 degree or 100 meter radius at a three three degree slope and then you can just run it out and you can go so far but it's telling you up there in real time how many meters of track you're laying uh which is really cool and then you can build it and then just lock on to the next piece and okay here you know i'm going underground so i don't want to do that and just run flat it's really really good like it used to be a real pain and then just like, you know, okay, I want to switch on here. Well, you use your numpad two and like four to rotate left and six. Numpad two gives you different attach points of your switches. And then as long as you see the little chain link there, it's going to link into that and just snap right to it. It's, it's so good. Um, the old, the old track lane system was a real nightmare. This one is so much better. So that's just very basic how to do track and bridges. And I mean, we every piece of track that you see on here, um, we've laid. I wouldn't say that I've done it all because I haven't, but uh, it's it's really awesome. And yeah, I haven't played. I haven't tried Railway in Part Two, but uh, this this game is is really good. Station A, Station B, I got gotcha. you. Now you can also kind of free build. So, oh, here, let me show you that too. So that's like if you are setting like a certain thing. But say I have this switch here, which I want at this angle. And then say I have a switch over here. And it's going to be at this angle. Which I don't know why you'd ever do this, but hey, uh, you can. So we're going to attach it here and then we're going to hit numpad five to unlock. So this gives us free mode. So we can, we can, oh, it's not cooperating, not cooperating, but we can like freehand build and then you see so you get into like all kinds of weird curvy tracks, which obviously you wouldn't want to do that. But if we want to like attach the two, you do that and then the game will figure out what kind of radius and stuff you need and elevation and everything. So it just makes track building. It's so, it's so much easier than it used to be. It's it's really good. And uh, I don't know how many hours necessarily we have into track lane on this map, but um, here if I bring down, this is an extension, kind of a mod that you run along with it, um, called Railroads Online Extended, and it's not made by uh, the company or anything. It's not made by Railroads, but it's it's an extension that works with the game that you can run with the game. And basically, it's a map, but it's so much more than a map. Uh, so we can come on here and say, okay, this is at the oil field. I want to flip uh, that switch and this switch and that switch and that switch. I can I can flip all these switches from the program. So if my trains, if I'm pulling in with my train, I can set up all my switches and have it all done uh, before I get there over here in my roundabout if I wanted to. Um, like I could mess with the guys right now. I could actually, so this is Trent's engine. I can open the controls and I can, I'm blowing his with the whistle on his train right now. Is that loud Trent? Trent? <laughs> I don't know, but I could move his engine. You can control cars. You can control engines. You can actually, if you have multiple engines, uh, one of the really cool features is if you have multiple engines, you can actually pin the controls together. So you would drive from one engine, but you control multiple engines. 
it's really really cool to run double headers in this game i i think it's a ton of fun personally we haven't done it yet on this map on this save but our, our last save we did it a bunch um we did have to restart saves with an update that came out but that that update also gave us the unreal 5 engine so like i'm okay having to restart you know for unreal 5 it's totally fine so we got to get pulled around and get loaded up here but that's just some basics about the game and it's you know, I'm not partnered with them or anything, but I would highly recommend if you're a train enthusiast at all, you know, it's it's a ton of fun. It's a ton of pull, fun. Yeah, pull forwards to Trent. Trent, was that train whistle loud? It, it might have been just a little bit. Okay. <laughs> just, just a little bit. Um, no it, it's so loud he can't. He, can't. he might be, his eardrums might be like blown out right now. I don't know. <laughs> that or he like got up from his computer or something. But, He's probably out making him a ham sandwich and he just uh, fell to the floor. Salami. Salami. Baloney. Baloney. That's Bologna. <laughs> oh man. Oh, I was making myself ramen. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah, some kind of food. I mean, farm sim, construction sim, yeah. That time it took a little bit longer each, each time I ran back was <laughs> where I wanted cars. <laughs> oh man, wait till you see this run up to the uh, coal mine. I'm going to load up a bunch of train rail basically and haul it up to the coal mine and it's it's a really awesome run. Really Hello, awesome. Brother. Runs the river. It's a beautiful run. So. We'll be doing that here in a few. Now, obviously, I will say, I mean, I'm very positive when it comes to this game, but I definitely need to say that there are issues with the game. It does crash. It's a beta game. We're on an experimental update technically right now for it. Too. So it's very like, you know, it will crash. You will have issues, but early access, you know, beta updates like it's it's bound to happen and it's okay, you know? It's definitely okay, but overall this game, it's it's a ton of fun, I love it. Pull four is just a little bit, Trent. This is the game sometime like on Sunday nights yeah, when good. I'm just like wanting to chill. I'll, I'll just put this on and just play off stream, run trains, tons of fun. All right, we're gonna slam on the brakes. Trying to get slowed down here. Right. Oh yes, you can derail. <laughs> Is it definitely, new? Definitely can do that. <laughs> Chuck, you are such a troll sometimes. You know that. Who did next to me? Who did? Okay, okay. Hey. All right. Look it. Chuck, you're such a troll. You're such a troll. Am I good then, but Uh, should be. As long as your last car loaded. Dude, he left you. He, he got tired of waiting on the ham sandwiches. Uh, it was, was loaded the last car. So. Wow. Okay, Trent, you are needing switches. You are good there. And you're going that way. Okay, so I got to go. You have to let me go first, though, Trent. Wait, how do I get there? Oh, I got to hit that loop backtrack. Okay, Trent, you need to hold at the second Y. Does that make sense? Because I got to go first. Oh, you got to come back up here. I got to go up there, hit that loop back right at the sawmill. And then I can come back. You could actually go sit inside that loop back if you wanted to. You know what I'm talking about? Or no? So. Huh? I think so. There you go. You got stream up. Okay, this is the loop back here that I'm talking about right next to the sawmill. You could go sit inside of that loop back if you wanted to. I think there's plenty of room there. Switches are set. We're ready for you. But yeah, I got to go up here so I can loop back to go. Yeah, because we don't have other track yet for that, which is fine. All... I mean, I can sit right before that, that little loop. That switch there at the loop track. You gotta sit there, yeah. You can't go any farther. Yeah, that's yeah. Okay. Chat, 
Chaz, I, I, I did. The dandelion. dandelion. I, hey, for the record, I was trying to find that. Or first, I mentioned the dandelion like meme in Teamspeak, and I posted like a little YouTube video of it, and then like, I don't know, it was funny. Construction sim annoyed you with what? I mean, there's, yeah, it was a fun game. Actually, speaking of construction sim chat, Tuesday, noon central. As long as the uh, DLC slash updates out, we're playing that on stream. Okay. It's not a dandelion. What is it? It looks like a dandelion. <laughs> Must be the last one. <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was funny. Okay. <laughs> Die in the line. Farmer Nick's still lurking. Look at you, Farmer Nick. Interesting. Looked like a day in the line to me. <laughs> Controls. Yeah, oh, true. I did about the Luke Combs thing. Yes. Um, The controls are a little weird in construction sim. Yeah. They definitely are. Most of this game is mouse. Uh, you can hit like W to get 2% of your regulator, which you can't see because it's behind me. Uh, then S to put your regulator down, which is nice for when you're in the yard here and stuff. But, uh, I, yeah. I think all the controls are on keyboard. I don't know no if more. break is though. Um, I want, I, if it is, I need to change it to like A and D and then you can just like drive the train with that, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Well, let's let's go look at the controls. I I got time. Okay. For real, for real. All right. Yeah, it Trent, takes a minute. You are. Oh yeah, yeah. Loading up rail. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna stop right before the switch. Loading up rail kind of takes forever because there's ten per car. Mm -hmm. And and they're they're kind of heavy too. So, Trent, you might have to push me to get up the hill. <laughs> I can come down there. Oh, I didn't think about that. Yeah, actually. Well, no, I should be okay. Wait, no. Yeah, I've hauled, uh, no, I've hauled a load of rail up to the cell before. If you want to drive down here, you can. I'm not going to stop you, but I, I won't need help up the hill. I forgot. I have to go up the really steep hill. Yeah, I have to go up the really steep hill. I forgot about that. But I've done it before with this. I did it last uh, Monday. Uh, you, that's holding, how you made over a thousand dollars right here on this train to buy your engine. I'm holding right before the switch. That's fine. I've uh, flipped it for you. Okay, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Bats. So, John, if you press V, what does it do? Press what? V on your <laughs> keyboard. V is in Victor? Yep. That zooms in. Zooms in, zooms out. Okay. Have they said when the next farm sim would come out? Not that I'm aware of, no. On the day it comes out. Yeah. CBM uh, Gaming, what's up, man? How you doing today? It's, uh, it's going. How are you? Is that full? Okay. Yep. Oh. And this is 14% regulator. These are so heavy. So heavy. It's only almost 5,000 pounds. Okay. Bye, Chaz. Arson's uh, a... Should be good. Arson, you bullying right now? I don't bully. Why are you bullying? <laughs> I don't bully. Bye. <laughs> Yeah. Man, I can't imagine how much custom bearings cost Vigorous Bull. Yes is the answer to that. Uh-huh. Yeah, I think Dad found that company too, and I'm just like, I'll put the old ones back in. <laughs> that or I need to go find a junk bee somewhere, but it would probably have junk bearings, so... Like, what's the point then, you know? Just saying. Yeah. Yeah, I I don't know. 
I don't think that would uh, I would want to go that route. I think we're just gonna pack them with some good grease and slap it back together and wish you good luck. But see, the the thing we're not gonna do any more of is like that that tractor actually has a lock for the clutch. Okay. And the whole time the tractor's running, the input shaft is spinning in the transmission, which means the reverse gears are spinning too. Okay? So if you put the lock on the clutch, then the transmission, nothing in the transmission is spinning. So if we're going to be running the engine, say a bunch, to like, you know, finish working on it, um, just, you know, just, just lock the clutch out, you know? Just saying. I think it'll be fine, though. What are the dimensions? I can... Uh, Post them all on Discord later, Dave. What? Go back? I think my hard drive just disconnected. Okay, I was gonna like... There it is. Yep, it just yep. reconnected. Mm -hmm. Yep, hard drive G. Yep. I thought it was mine that I remembered that I upgraded to Windows 11 and it doesn't make that noise anymore. It means you can stop now. I didn't do that. It's just doing stuff over here. I don't know, man. Sorry. I didn't touch anything. Okay, head two, please. Golly, man. <laughs> I didn't touch a single thing. Must be a daddy lion, okay? <laughs> it's such a stupid video, but it's so funny. Uh, and good. Grab some firewood. This this engine's starting to like show that it's down on firewood or this tender. Kinda funny. Kinda funny. Alright. Okie dokie. Um, Dave, let's put it this way. Pops has it all in millimeters. <laughs> so I, I'm just going to say it, whatever. ID is, uh, uh, 19.05 millimeter. The OD is uh 26.99 millimeter. And apparently the length is, uh, 24.61 millimeter. So yeah, that's what he has. That's why I say if you want me to post it later, I will. I'll post them. I can post it all on Discord later. Oh yeah. They're not broke, so why fix them? So they're very uh they're very noisy, vigorous bowl. Like when you uh spin them, you know, put your finger in there and spin them. They're they're kinda noisy. Just turn up the music louder. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so at that point if they're starting to make noise, yeah, they're they're basically broken. Yeah. yeah. So I think the idea is probably to go on Amazon and, and buy some magnets and uh, put some magnets. There's three, technically there's three chambers kind of to the transmission and one's the BTO, but kind of it all shares the same fluid, right? Uh -huh. So put three magnets in the bottom of the transmission and just, you know, say a prayer and move on. You know, I think that's the strat. That's a, not a bad idea. Yeah. That's what that JPN guy did with his Alice. He he actually glued in magnets, but I was like, why would you glue them in? It's a like it's not an aluminum housing, you know. But Let's I, go ahead. Um, sometimes magnets move, just, especially when you have a rotating mass of iron. Bro. It kind of creates like a magnet or electro electro magnet, essentially. I don't know. Just, uh, yep, I mean, they're still going to support it for a while, while Vigorous Bull. They did that with 10 or, or 7 or all, all the old operating systems. That's what they do. Like 2026. Not, not everybody's going to up, update like all the way and or right away. Uh, Should be good there. All right. Or, you know, <laughs> just like... Oh, oh, First time can probably correct me, but like not that long ago, realistically, a couple of years now, where Dad works, they just upgraded to Windows 10. A couple of years ago, you know. 
just like way after the fact, right? So yeah, it's a whole thing. It's a vibe. Not everybody's going to upgrade right away. Are these last ones? Yes. All right, good. That and just also upgrading. Uh, some people might need to get a new PC. Yeah, because there's that thing about like, you know, system requirements too. So oh. it's, a, it's a whole thing. So yeah, they're not just going to be like, well, here's Windows, you know, 11. Uh, 10 is turned off. We've officially stopped support on the same day. That would be a problem. So yeah. Yeah. Oh, a lot of businesses would be unhappy. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. So if they did that, the amount of computers that would have to be upgraded because like they wouldn't support the uh -huh. new Windows. You wouldn't be able to buy like any motherboards ever. You wouldn't be able to. Yeah, you wouldn't yeah, be able to do like, that or like. They'd be like graphics cards these days. Yeah, office computers Not would be like so hard to find. Mm -hmm. Or even just basic computers. Too. That's what I'm saying. Basic computer, office computer, same thing. Yeah. As I mean, laptops. our computers can be used in your office. Yeah, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> it just might be overkill for depending on what your job you is think? in your office. <laughs> we still have 19 core wood here. Let's go. An office computer with a 4090 in it. What's it to you? <laughs> 64 gigs Dude, of RAM. You should see the spreadsheets, okay? <laughs> they are lit, bro. Actually, the the RAM thing actually is it does make sense, yeah. Your uh, office computer for certain spreadsheets. Yeah, true. Yeah, but look at we got a 4090 in it. No, yeah. that doesn't help. Dude, I, my office computer is a liquid cooled, okay? Custom loop, all right? That'd be my sick. office computer is dipped in mineral oil. <laughs> Those okay. are so cool. They are, but they are a nightmare for maintenance. Mine have a little fish swimming in it. <laughs> Ready to go. Magnet idea sounds great. Yeah, I think that's probably the strat. And if they, if they blow up, then well, then I gotta go buy a parts tractor, I guess. Or something. No boo hoo. <laughs> I wouldn't want to buy a parts tractor. That'd be kind of sad. Although there is a local guy. I don't. Dad said he was gonna call him, but I don't think he ever did. Uh, he's a guy that buys tractors out of fence rows and stuff and takes them apart and sells them in, in pieces and we've i don't want to say we're friends with the guy or anything but we've we've purchased a few things from him the plow came from him uh the alice plow that we have and then um 